Hey guys, welcome back to Colson Scooters. I'm Colson Smith, and in today's video, we're here in Dallas. Um, we're about to go into the Reefa Palooza show. I'll see you when we get inside. So we made it to the airport. We're waiting to board the plane right now. I'm even charging my computer so I can edit on the plane. You ready, Dad? Court order to nowhere. <laughs> off the plane yeah. that was the longest two hours of our life and tons of, and kids. Tons of kids crying um, we just got to Dallas uh, they actually have a fish tank hey they probably don't even know that these yellow tanks are about a thousand bucks each now they probably have no idea oh that's a juice of Mary tank yeah that's really expensive got the naso look the little yeah. all right we're gonna go grab some food um, we'll see y'all when we get to the hotel All right, we finally made it. We are in the room. I'm gonna give y'all a little room tour. So when you first walk in, you got the little living room, the TV. We got a table over here, a little kitchen area, a little mini fridge. Uh, there's my bag. Uh, then in here, we got the two beds, one for me, one for my dad. Got another TV set up, and then the bathroom over there. Hi, dad. Hey. He's making it freezing cold 65. in here. 65, dad. <laughs> All right, it has been a long day. I'll catch y'all in the morning when we're at Reef of Palooza. <laughs> All right, we're here at uh, Reef of Palooza in Texas. We got an early thanks to Coral View. Huge shout out to them. Um, we're gonna go find their booth at some point here. Um, we're just gonna show you around a little bit and see what we can find. All right, so this is actually day two of the show. So we came here, um, we didn't come on Saturday, we came here Sunday and, um, just because my dad's work schedule is the way it worked out. Um, we usually come on Sundays to the show anyway. They're kind of a slower day and people usually do more deals on Sunday for coral wise um, because they're trying to not bring it back to where they're from. Yeah. These awesome clams, look at that. Oh yeah, yeah, for sure, yeah. Get my lens out so y'all can see a little better. That's crazy. around um, coral views here I said hi to them already um, we're gonna get them in a couple in the video at some point um, huge shout out to them make sure you check out them um, they are a wholesaler so you can't really buy straight from them um, you can check out you know top shelf aquatics where I work as well and we can get you whatever products they have on their website So what's your favorite coral you guys have? We're here with uh, ReefWorks. Uh, it's probably the ReefWorks, the college fund that college we got right fund. here. Yeah, I was almost looking at that one, that's awesome. This happened in our tank, so it's a natural graft. And I spent the last like year and a half transfer, you know, like growing it out and making it into pieces that I can bring and sell. So yeah, that's pretty that's awesome. awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, man. I've already walked around like 10 times, but we finally got my dad in here. Um, we're gonna take him around, show him around this place. Yeah, please. Uh, there's some pretty cool corals here, so okay. let's go. All right. Hello. 
just worry about that cut slowly for. Awesome move. Pretty cool. Thank you. Awesome. Just chills on your neck. You oh, care, yeah. care if I film? Nope. Yeah, I'll do it too then. What's his name? Biggie Cheese. Biggie Cheese. Yep, he's got some stickers of him. Oh, he's so cool. Man, he's going for the camera. That's a cool shot. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, he's photogenic. He knows when a camera's on. Oh, yeah. He likes that. Or he thinks this is like a mouse or something. Right? He's like, ooh. Food? First, we gotta stop by at the Coral View booth. What's going on, Connor? Hey, what's up, dude? How you doing? Good, man. Thanks for coming out to Reef and Blues. Uh, for sure. Why don't you tell me about the uh, hydro system? For sure. So we have our whole workshop over here to kind of show you, showcase how Hydros actually works. You get your hands on the app and everything. All right. But of course, we have the big touch screen on our webpage, so you guys at home can actually see this too and what's going on. But it gives you a little bit of a brief description about what all the controls are, what ports they offer. Because with Hydros, you could start with any single one of our controls and expand out from there as your system grow. Colson knows he's got a lot of nano tanks and as he grows those nano tanks or gets more, he can start to add on more Hydros devices onto his system to control and monitor whatever aspects he wants. And to see a little bit of what Hydros has to offer. Now we have even more than this, but everything is color coordinated. So we have some of the green sensors over here and the green are sense port items. So when you see a green port on Hydros, know that you can plug in a sense port accessory like a TDS meter like a temperature sensor, water level sensor, skimmer sensor, leak detector, rope leak detector, and anything like that, you can start to monitor and control your aquarium. So that way we keep it safe, redundant, and high tech and fun. So check us out if you're in Reef of Blueza, but Colson's Critters is a great page and we look forward to see those videos come out as they drop. So obviously check out the Coral View products, but we're gonna take a look at some of the other things here at Reef of Palooza. I gotta find my dad, I don't even know where he went. Uh, he ditched me, probably because I was just filming a bunch. Uh, but let's go find my dad. There you are. Everybody around here saying they're nice. Uh, the ones he was pointing out, these guys, the smaller ones are 125, the bigger ones are 200. The Superman's 225, that guy there is 200. And they got these disc, little disc bouquets here, 200 bucks for the whole disc. There's a contract. Oh, look at that. Hey, you put them all in. That's him. Appreciate it. These are absolutely insane. It's coming down there. Yeah, well, how much is the bottom of the... No, no, that's, that's when it came down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. How much it. did you have in the beginning? No, you should be asking them. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It's so bright it won't even... Reverse tiger. Is that what you that's call awesome. It? Is that your favorite coral at the booth? Yeah, I think so. Yeah? Yeah. 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 So which one that's my you favorite. Have? It's gotta be you. What's up? I said which oh, one you yeah, yeah. <laughs> Care if he puts you on YouTube? No, not at all. Sure. Yeah, cool. Here with What's your favorite corals right now in your booth? Ooh, there, I'm gonna choose three. There's that's a lot cool. of good ones. Yeah, that's cool. So I really like this mushroom, the cushion mushroom here. That's pretty sick. And I really like. Well, I like these two that are next to each other as well. That mushroom and this yeah, plastic those are musa. Huge. That's a plastic. Wow. wow. And then check this chalice out. It has a. It actually has a black edge, then pink, then green. That's pretty sick. The black actually makes the pink pop. And if you didn't even say anything about that, I wouldn't have even. Usually, you see me in like this. Time. And a lot of people think it's a mushroom. So that's pretty cool. It's definitely a chalice. <laughs> Here with addictive corals. What's your favorite coral at your booth right now? Right now, it's probably going to be the kamikazes. These zones right here grow pretty oh, fast. They got a nice pink center in them. Yes, thank you. Those are awesome. Where are you located? Miami, Florida. Miami, Florida. Sweet. Tons of zoas selection. With Lone Star Coral, what's your favorite coral at your booth right now? Uh, that'd be the radioactive tenuous. It's good. 
Which one is that? Nice bright coloration. Oh wow. Combination of orange, purples, and then yeah, bright that's green. Super pretty. What a beautiful piece right there. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Got some pretty nice scullies, some enemies, some nice trachees. You having fun? Yeah, I am. Did you see the sunburst? Oh yeah, that enemy? It's pretty sick. Look at all these zoas. That just looks so cool. Hey, we use this. This is the light I used to use. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm always a sucker for plate corals. Remember we bought one that was like brown or like that one and it ended up turning out like awesome in my tourney on. Yeah. yeah. And then we got some uh, gorgs over here. Super cool. They don't have the blood shrimp and stuff this time. All right, so we've been here for a couple hours now. We actually met some of you guys, which is pretty cool. Um, if you ever see me and just walk around, don't feel free just to just come up and say hi. I love it. Absolutely love it. It was pretty cool. Yeah, it was um, awesome. We're probably gonna go grab some lunch and then come back. Uh, what do you think? Wanna grab some lunch? Yeah, let's do that. I'm pretty hungry, so. Yeah. yeah. I'll see you guys when we come back. Alrighty, guys, that's a wrap for, well, wrap or Reef of Palooza, Texas. Um, we had so much fun. I got to meet a couple of you guys. Um, like I said earlier in the video, if you do see me, just come up and say hi. It made my day for sure. Take a picture with a couple of you guys um, and actually get to meet you. Sadly, we didn't end up getting any corals this year um, just because we didn't really want to take it back on the plane with us. But if you guys like these videos, let me know by just hitting that like button. We'll make some more videos coming to these shows like Reef of Palooza or Aqua Shell or anything like that. Huge shout out to Coral View again um, for bringing me out here and getting me in, uh, getting me in early and all that. Uh, and yeah, till next time. Peace.